give me a sign. Does God really send me email? And the rubber stamp from above. I'm Lenny Solomon, and this is The Lenny Solomon Show. Hi, everybody, and welcome to Webisode 14, the season one finale to The Lenny Solomon Show. In today's episode, we talk about getting a sign from God and getting email from God. In 2001, I put out this album called God Sent Us Email. So the question is, does God really send us email? Does God give us signs? Does God really talk to us? People would come over to me and say, come on, Lenny, what is God really? He has time to talk to you? He has time to talk to me? Come on, he's busy running the world. And the answer is no. He doesn't have limitations. We were created in the image of God. So every time you get a message from somebody, you get an email from somebody, you get somebody talking to you, it's really God using this person as a vehicle. Let's go over to the piano and hear God sent us email. God sent us email. Said I've told you what to do. I left you the commandments. Now the choice is up to you. God sent us email. And every single day, you can open up the book of life. And choose the right way He talks to us He's always testing us Oh, can you see Him? Can you feel Him? Can you hear Him? Do you want to? And now, stories from the road. You know, when you start a business, they always say you need a business plan. You need demographics. Who are you going to appeal to? You need to understand where are you putting your advertising money. So that was the greatest thing about Schlockrock because I had no business plan. I had no demographics. But you know what I did have? I had a rubber stamp from God because you could have all the greatest plans in the world. But if God doesn't say yes, it ain't going to happen. And so, my friends, I would tell you go out there. Besides making your business plan, pray to God and say, God, rubber stamp so that I can do what I have to do. Hope you enjoyed the season. See you next time. I'm Yisrael Chai.